All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. I am Salazar. Thank you for joining me. Um, today I'm just gonna show off the um, the new um, Pikachu V Union collection box from the Celebration Set. We'll go through that in a minute. I'm um, featuring my buddy Psyduck, but he's going to be in the background just over, or sorry, in the foreground, just over here, chilling out, like it's all Psyducks do. Um, I've got a new Psyduck for my collection, as you don't know, um, I collect Psyducks because he's my favourite Pokemon. So um, if anyone on the channel has any spare, like, old school Psyducks or classic Psyducks from maybe old, just any odd sets of Psyduck, um, I'd be greatly appreciated of the message if you guys have any and I'll be happy to buy them off you if you guys are willing to sell them. Um, not sure what set this one is from but it is absolutely beautiful. It's a Wizard of the Coast one so it's fairly old. Um, I really love the artwork on Akari. Such a little, such a little dumb side like he fell over and hurt himself but it's just adorable. Honestly look at that. That is beautiful. So thank you to um, Trent Cooper who sent me that one out. Um, I think he lives, oh god, I forgot where he lives, might be, well, might be Auckland, might not be, um, but anyway, massive, massive shout out to Trent Cooper for that beautiful card, anyway, gonna get, gonna get, gonna get into the Pikachu V Union box, which the uh, artwork for that looks fantastic, the shine on the box looks amazing, and we'll go through the V Union because a lot of people might not know what a V Union is, like, especially if you're brand new and you're thinking, what the heck's a V-Union? Um, but anyway, it comes with four packs of celebrations, which I'll keep off to the side just in front of me here. And two extra packs, that is including uh, Battle Style. So we've got a chance of the Alt Art, um, Rapid Stroke Urshifu. And we've got Darkness Blaze, which you've got a chance at the Charizard VMAX. Um, so in this box, it comes with... And I'm just going to unplug this thing. Where are they? Where is it on here? Oh, there it is. Okay. So, Alright. So we've got a brand new card we want to talk about. Um, which is for, made for V Union Pokemon. It's unfortunately not even a hollow, which is kind of disappointing. They could have made the, the card a hollow. But it is Professor Burnett. Um, and the card allows you to search your deck for up to two V Union cards. Oh, sorry, up to, sorry, up to, sorry. I'll reread that. Um, search your deck for up to two cards and discard them. So this card allows you to, basically you can search for anything and discard them, but you'd prefer to just discard the V Union cards that are in your deck and um, discard them because you need all four pieces of the puzzle of the V Union to get the card into play. So, you know what, we're going to look at the V Union. Um, we've got the oversized card, which we'll have a look at in a minute to go over their text with. Um, but essentially, they come in four different pieces of, of a part of a puzzle. And in order to play the card, obviously, with, you have to get them all in the discard pile to play it. And I think they're bloody beautiful. Look at that. The artwork on these, on this card, well, on all four of these, is amazing. And it all adds up together, which you'll see in the big giant promo in a minute. Uh, put them there. Right here. So it all adds up until that once the card is in play. And it's got four attacks. We're going to read them here. Your first attack, which is up the top here, is Union Game. I'll read it here. So Sorry, my camera's not really focusing. Don't know why. Um, would like it to. There you go, that might be better. Um, so it allows you to attach up to two lightning energy from your discard pile to the Pokemon. So... That's pretty good to start accelerating energy to it. Um, next attack, which is next to it. I'll just find that piece of the puzzle. There it is. So it's called Sh Sh Shocking Shock. Kind of a cool name. Um, it's, up, it's up there. Yeah, it's up there. All right, cool. So it costs two lightning, uh, one lightning and a colorless energy to use the attack. Does 120 damage, flip a coin. If heads, your opponent's active Pokemon is paralyzed. Pretty, pretty good attack there. Um, I reckon, in my opinion, this here is the best attack for the card, uh, which is down the bottom here. Um, and it's called Disconnect. I'm pretty sure that's where it is. Nope, there. 
Yep, all right there. All right, so disconnect for 150 damage for two lightning energy in its colorless. You, during your opponent's next turn, they can't play any item cards. So it's 150 damage and item lock. I think that's extremely good in the game, in my opinion. And then the last attack down here for also two lightning and a colorless electro ball together for 250 damage. So pretty awesome. I love this whole card. I'm not sure how competitive it's going to be with Rapid Strike Urshifu we're still out there. And this thing is weak to fighting, so not the best matchup if you come against a Rapid Strike match. But if you don't, um, could be an interesting matchup. Obviously, 300 damage is actually pretty easy to get through in the Pokemon TCG, so... Um, I mean, you could probably play a type of toughness on that or something. But anyway, we'll get into these packs. We've got Darkness and Blaze here, so we've got a Lightning Energy. Go figure. There goes Semi Sage, got a Pans. What's that? No, that was a Semi Poor. There was a Semi Sage. Alright, Rare Fossil, Diglett, Tauros, uh, Pan Sage, Wishy Washy, Rookie D's Notes, Reverse Aaron. And we got a um, muck. That was a white coat and it eared me. Okay. Nice to know that Darkness of Blaze essentially has error packs now. Because that was a white coat pack. And I just got a, a regular rare out of it. Good to know. Alright. Next pack here is Battle Styles. Alright. Two, three, four. All right, we've got a Psychic Energy. We've got a Livable, which is a very playable card. Evil Morpeko. Tall Jammer, which is another playable card. Cacnea. Splink. Rolly Colly. Uh, Ferelish. Esper. Reverse Rare Colossal. And a Hollow Kingdra out of Battle Styles. Um, I didn't mind that. That was a pretty good card. A pretty good pack there so we'll move on and let's see if we can pull our third Charizard shall we all right first pack here of celebrations there's the code off to the side and then we've got Zekrom, Cosmoan, Dark Gyarados again I've already got that and another Flying Pikachu which I'm kind of I'm kind of maybe thinking should I add that to the deck but I might just make that one whole deck. Because the Flying Pikachu isn't a bad card from what I've seen, but this hasn't really seen play at the moment. Alright, so that's what we've got here. We've got a Yiva tool, we've got a Kyogre, which is a meme deck. I thought it was Charizard for a second. And a uh, Surfing Pikachu V Max. So two different Pikachu V Maxes and two different packs. Pretty pretty weird, but alright. Guess that, well this is a Pikachu box, so might as well pull the Pikachu's right. Alright, next pack here. Put that off to the side. Alright, so we've got a Palkia. Got a Reshiram. Ooh, this is a new one. We've got a Cleffer from... Uh, God knows what set. I don't know what set this came in, but apparently it was playable back in the day. This is a Cleffer. And it's another Professor's Research. Great card. So that... Cliff is going to go into the classic collection folder. I'm only collecting the classic cards from celebrations, so that's how that's going to go. Alright, last pack here of celebrations and in general. Alright, Zekrom. Cosmoan. Alright, so we're not getting another Charizard. But we've got a Zacian V, which goes in a lot of psychic decks these days. And it's probably going to help out new VMAX in the format. Alright guys. So hopefully you enjoyed the um, video. If you did, leave a like. Go subscribe to the channel for more content. And me and Psyduck will see you in the next episode. Later. Later.